Here I'm looking at all kinds of fish, but as you see here, there's a good sized calico that pops up in front of me. I'm actually looking for a much bigger calico. That was definitely a keeper, but looking for something bigger as I have seen quite a few.
today we're gonna be making some lobster porto nuevo and some lo uh, lobster ravioli. Alright, bring in a tablespoon of olive oil into our little batter mix here. Go ahead and pour that in. Perfect. Now we're gonna take a fork and we're gonna mix that up inside and slowly get it into a bowl. So Parker's mixing it all up inside and then you slowly work your way outside, slowly getting everything combined. Alright, my four pound lobster going in. Head first. All right, can't forget about all the fish that I shot. So tons of meat here, some turban snail. And what one of the things that I wanted to do was actually try the difference between dried sheephead versus freshly caught and frozen sheephead. Here's the frozen and freshly caught, which was really tasty. And then second is the dry age. And I will tell you that Face to face, nothing else. The dried sheep head definitely won hands down. All right, I just want to send a really big thank you to everybody that helped get me this, this very first lobster. And so Miguel, Anthony, Ivan, Jeff, thank you guys so much. And not only that, it was a four pound lobster. Not a bad start. And also to everybody that watches this, I just, I truly love sharing this with everybody just because I love being underwater and, and it's fun to see everything and be able to share that with you and be able to hopefully inspire you guys just like others are inspiring me uh, on different ways to cook the fish from Taku, uh, Outdoor Chef Life, absolutely amazing if you haven't checked him out. Of course, Bodie Moss over at Young Bloods, check him out. Um, there are many, many more people out there that I would love to thank and just for their inspiration for me to do this and I've just absolutely loved every minute of it. Thank you for everybody with all your comments and also for subscribing and checking this out. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like these, definitely click like and subscribe and see you on the next one. Cheers.